Oh, that's normal. Look at her. She's just sat in a fridge, molesting a mollusk. Look at how wet that pillow is. Look at how wet that pillow is. Why is there an octopus in this scenario? Hello guys, how you doing? It's me, Jack. Now, I've spent all day educating myself on somebody that, as of this morning, I didn't know existed. I will admit, originally, this video was going to be completely different to the title that you see. I actually had three brand new other video ideas that I was going to do today, and these are those. New vid ideas. But I don't think the internet's ready for that yet, because this morning, about 9am, I got a Discord call from my friend Jordan. Hello, mate. You all right? Fuck the small talk, mate. I've got something big for you. Right, okay. Two words. Belle Delphine. Uh, see, I've seen this name crop up, mate. I've not got a clue. What is it? Okay, right. Layman's terms, yeah. Imagine Ollie White. Yeah. Grows some tits. <laughs> yeah. Sells his own bath water 30 quid. What are you saying? <laughs> I'd be fuming, Jordan. Not only that, mate. The bath water's giving people herpes, Jack. <laughs> Fucking herpes. <laughs> Fuck off. No, mate, I'm just sitting on Twitter's trend and she's selling her own fucking piss. Oh, fuck off. It's so dehydrated, mate. <laughs> right, I'll do a video. See you later, Jordan. Oh, mate, please out. So convenient that I just had the camera set up and everything. It's mad, isn't it? It's lucky. I asked a few of my YouTube counterparts to explain Belle Delphine to me, and here's what a couple of them had to say. Unfortunately, Mr. Jack, mate, you've come to the wrong place because all I know about Belle Delphine is she cracks eggs on herself and that she's, she sells bath water. She is an absolute legend. Um, if I could monetize my bath water, I'd be a very rich man. Uh, Belle, if you're listening to this in the video, let's meet up. Um, I'd love to know how I can start selling bath water or otherwise. Thank you. She does weird things on the internet. Uh, she basically sells people really weird things uh, uh, she doesn't really get fully like naked but like she might as well <laughs> belle delphine is a commercialized way for men to deny but also acknowledge publicly that they're masturbating over someone who is not appropriate to do either with if a website can be a shithole, Famous Birthdays is that. Cosplayer and baby doll model who rose to fame by posting fairy and kitten costume photos on her Belle.Delphine Instagram account. AKA a magnet for nonces. She's the 951st most famous person on this website, by the way. I wonder what I am. Okay, what are we gonna guess? Higher or lower? Am I more famous or less famous than Belle Delphine, the baby doll model? I'm definitely lower. Definitely lower. But how much lower? We'll find out. Fuck off! 5,000! That's mental! It, um, mind you, it could be worse. I shouldn't do this. This is only gonna aggravate me. I'm still gonna do it. If I'm 5,000th, yeah, I just wanna check something. Oh, piss off! Let's go back to Delphine. Oh, that's quite impressive, actually. She's the third most famous person born in South Africa. She's above Elon Musk. The bloke literally invented Tesla. <laughs> How the fuck is she above Eli She's more famous than Nelson Mandela! <laughs> I hate the internet. He's won a Nobel Peace Prize. What has Belle ever won? Hey, nothing. In fact, the closest she's ever come to a Peace Prize is this. <laughs> Get it? A Piss Prize. Apparently she's selling her own piss. We'll come to that later. Alright, uh, all I know is that this is that last... That Will keeps making videos about with a fucking pink hair and apparently she sells a fucking bath water and it's really dirty. <laughs> okay, right, so we're about to have a look at Belle Delphine's Instagram account. She's got 4.1 million followers. That is mental. There's boobs on it. There's boobs. I, I, I kind of get it now. She's got nipple tape that says fuck me on it. Um, this video is going to get age restricted. That's my ad revenue out the fucking window. Cheers, Belle. This is genuinely, on my life, this is the first time I have seen this woman's Instagram. And it won't be the last. That is a, that is a, that is a vi vibrating dildo. That's what that is. Let's get off that one, because I need the ad rev. Right, here we go. Here's the bath water one. The gamer girl bath water. I am now selling my bath water for all you thirsty gamers. She plays up to this. Who's buying this? Check out my new shop where I'm selling stuff for you. Not her, 
for you. Lush Suck says, did you pee in that bath by any chance? Dab? I don't know what bit's worse. The piss or the dab. The underscore weird underscore kid 25 says, hey, why are you selling stuff like bath water? That's what we're all thinking, weird kid 25. Nail on head with that one. If I pour your bath water in my bath water, does that mean we are bathing together? No. <laughs> How? No, it wouldn't. That's like saying if I eat a sausage roll and David Beckham eats a sausage roll, does that mean we've ate a sausage roll together? No, it doesn't. We've just both had sausage rolls in different places. It's the same with your bath. Does this mean we could have water that's touched your naked body? Yes, and it's going to be full of skin cells. You're actually going to own her naked body. Not lit, not... <sighs> the feminists are going to be out now, aren't they? I don't mean it like that. I mean, there's going to be skin cells in the water and you're gonna have some in a little tub on your shelf and that's normal apparently that's 2019 this sums up the fucking internet doesn't it right let's have a look at worthless bb's page what is prayer going to do <laughs> yeah exactly you are gonna need a lot more than prayer my boy right blimey blimey this is on my internet history now oh she's got a plaster on her nose has she hurt herself hello boyfriend <laughs> oh let's have a look at the comments on this it's gonna be gold hi love cute people says LMAO Sha. <laughs> God. Oh, not a chance, son. Not a fucking chance. Every fibre of my being is telling me not to do this. But I can't control myself, so let's click this one. I'm doing date night tonight on my snap. Where would you take me on a date? I don't know. Therapy? How about the cemetery so I could sacrifice you to the undead lord? What is this? These are the kind of people, right, that used to bark at school. You're not a gamer girl. Stop embarrassing our community. Are you a gamer girl? Let's have a look. <laughs> You're not a gamer girl either. Can we not let this guy near guns? Is that okay? No, I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say it. This is mental. If this photo gets one million likes, I'll actually make a Pornhub account. How many likes has this got? Two million. I'm gonna have to go on Pornhub, ain't I? This is gonna take a lot of blaring in the air. Belle Delphine. Belle Delphine squirts all over the floor. I just am clicking it, ain't I? <laughs> Fiona, it's for a video. I swear, I'm not wanking. Belle Delphine plays with her... Pussy. Listen, what is this? The donut. Squeaky donut. I see what she's doing, and she's got the internet on strings. So fair play to her. Belle Delphine strokes two big cocks. I already know it's gonna be chickens, and uh, or a couple of hens, and you can sign me up. <laughs> of course it is. Brilliant, brilliant. I like this person. Stroke then cocks, Delphine. Again, Fiona, it's for a... <laughs> Belle Delphine gets double penetrated. How's she getting out of this one? I'm gonna turn this off now. Okay, I don't think we can let this video go any further without delving deep into what this whole fucking bathwater escapade is all about. As my nan would say, let's do a Google. This Instagram model is selling her used gamer girl bathwater for $30 a jar. <sighs> Calm down, Jack. On Twitter, she advertised her new business venture as well, admitting she began bottling and selling her used bathwater because this is what humanity has come to. It's come to it because you're doing it. You can't do something bad and then go, oh, look at that, that's what humanity's come to. Hitler didn't kill hundreds of millions of Jews and then go, fuck me. Look at that, that's a mess. Look at what humanity's come to. Yeah, you've done that, Hitler. I've never heard of anyone else selling their bathwater. She's done it and she's gone, oh, this humanity. Three days later, her supplies sold in three days. <laughs> in three days. Wait, how do you sell out a bathwater? Just have another bath, Belle. <laughs> I thought she was a clever entrepreneur for a second. She's not. Just turn the old taps on. Get in the tub. Okay, so Belle posted an update. So my bath water sold out. Again, shouting. Needless. What the fuck? I will be making some more soon, but it's been, honestly, a weird couple of days taking so many baths. I tell you what, if I could sell my bath water for $30 a pot, you wouldn't get me out of the bath. I'd be prone to fuck. I heard on the grapevine that Belle Delphine is now selling a bottle of piss. Sorry, I've got to get the facts right. That's not true. That's not true. Apparently it was a jar of piss. Belle Delphine, jar of piss. Oh, it's fake. It's fake. Fake Belle Delphine gamer girl P goes on sale as trolls cash in on bathwater demand. Clever trolls have created a fake website pretending to be Belle Delphine selling a jar of game. Is that clever? You're selling piss. I was thinking to move on, but I've just realized there's a very integral part of this story. There's a big bit of this story, right? Did people 
contract herpes after drinking Instagram star Belle Delphine's bath water. I fucking hope so. Okay, this is a claim. More than 50 people contracted herpes from drinking bath water sold to them by the Instagram star. Oh, please. Please. I don't know if you can put the word masturbation in your... So can I say wank? Can I say, I'll say wank. They're wanking over a girl who looks young. Okay, right, this is the last bit of the video and it's probably the weirdest thing you will ever see in your life. Okay, we're on our YouTube now. Um, let's watch Belle's video. Meet my best friend. Okay, let's meet him, shall we? Or her? Probably her. Oh, uh, right. Okay, looking forward to it. Let's see your best friend. the fuck is that? What is that? Has she seriously stuck googly eyes on a dead octopus? Is that what she's done there? Imagine a bunch of octopi in an ocean, because that's where they live, obviously. Imagine they're all sat round, yeah, grieving the loss of their mate John. And they're like, I'm so gutted John's gone. I'm so gutted. He's got nothing now. He's dead. He's probably at the bottom of the ocean with the sand and the scum and the plankton. Is John down there with the sand and the scum of the plankton? Oh no, little do they know, he's fucking living his best life. But he's not living, he's dead, but John is doing more dead than any octopus has ever done alive. Think of that for a second. Fuck me, she is she is disgusting. She should be locked up for that kind of behaviour, that is too far. I mean, I knew she was a dirty bitch before, but that is too far. I mean, look at it. Look, who eats Marmite, the sick bitch? Oh, that's normal. Look at her. She's just sat in a fridge, molesting a mollusk. Look at how wet that pillow is. Look at how wet that pillow is. Why is there an octopus in this scenario? Although, admittedly, that could be another one for our old porn up account, couldn't it? Belle Delphine's wet puss. Octopus. Ruins. Furniture. I can feel that a lot of you are judging me as well because I use the phrase wet puss ruins furniture. But don't fucking judge me. Don't act as if I've just lowered the tone when this woman, this 19 year old woman, <laughs> is using a dead mollusk as a headrest. I love and hate this in equal measure. This is a day of my life I will never get back. And to be honest, I'm not sure I want it back. I'm embracing every moment of this. I bet her hair fucking stinks. Imagine that, going back to hers after a night out, you don't know who she is, but you've pulled her, or she's pulled you even, and you've gone back to hers. You get into bed, you think, ho oh, oh, we're now about to have sex. We're now about to ruin furniture. You notice that potent fishy smell, so you feel like you have to say something. Well. I don't know if this is normal or not, but you stink of raw fish. Straight away, without flinching, she whacks back the covers. <laughs> oh no, silly, it's not me. That's my dead octopus. Just there, all tentacles out like that. Oh, you should have said. <laughs> I didn't realise that you'd have a dead octopus in your bed with fucking googly eyes till taped to its head. <laughs> That's much more normal. Go on in, girl. Hop on. Should have said. I mean, admittedly, you are a dead octopus, so I guess... You can't afford to be too fussy. Imagine, <laughs> imagine being one of these girls. Yeah, you've not had much luck on Tinder because you're still on Tinder. And you get a match on a random Monday. You think, okay, maybe my luck's in. Maybe my luck's about to change. Oh, no. No. It's a, it's a dead sea mollusk. Although, admittedly, that's probably not the first time that any of those girls have come across a slimy creature on Tinder that's absolutely dead in the bedroom. Am I right, girls? Okay, back to dead fish. Don't kiss it. Do not kiss it, she's definitely got hepatitis B. Oh, she's put it in the bath. Look on the bright side, at least she doesn't sell that bath water. Actually, I don't know why I'm angry, that's fucking brilliant. People are drinking slimy octopus fucking bath water. Slimy dead octopus bath water, this is brilliant. Making it rain on a dead octopus, she's probably the first person to ever do that. What the fuck would David Attenborough say if he saw this? I know exactly what David Attenborough would say. Because I've edited together a little something for you. My friend Schaefer Bates, impressionist, go and have a look. Has, uh, helped me make this. Here we have internet e thought Belle Delphine, manhandling a dead mollusk. Although slimy to the touch and disgustingly potent in smell, this tiny creature has millions of fans on her Instagram page. Here we watch as Belle dresses up this sea animal in an array of small funky accessories. This octopus is truly on fleek. Who said all plastic was bad for sea creatures after all? How good was that line? I wrote that. I should do comedy properly, shouldn't I? I'm wasted in this shed. Here we find Delphine in her natural habitat, the fridge, rubbing tentacles tentatively across naked thighs. Oh, how I wish it was my testicles she was rubbing tentatively instead. 
What a lucky little fucker this octopus is. <laughs> fucking love that. This is my best video I've ever made. I've had more fun making this video than I've ever made. It, it, it may have even topped beans and burgers for me. So there we go, guys. If you did enjoy this video, please do hit a thumbs up. And if you didn't for some reason, because you're a boring bastard, then do that. It really makes no difference. Please do subscribe, guys. I make videos here on this channel whenever I can be asked. And for now, I'm off. <laughs> Fiona, fetch me Harry the Dead Haddock. I'm off for a shower. It's not pleasant, is it, when you think about it? When you think about the people that watch it, it's weird. That's the bit. It's not the actual thing. Because when you see it online, you go, oh, what a sweet little girl who sells her bath water. The weird bit is if they're all doing it in the same room and having to look at each other, then they'd all think it was weird. Because they'd go, oh, these are the other weirdos that do this shit. <laughs> You'll be blogging your merch too much. You'll be blogging your merch too much. Beans and burgers.